All right, so here I am in Revit. I have this spamdeck.rfa family file that you sent to me. Uh, it's open here. If I select it, um, I can see that it's a family. It's actually part of a sweep system. So if I click Edit Sweep, it will give you the path and the actual profile that you're working with. If you select this profile, you can see the name of it here. Once you know what that name is, you can go here under Project Browser right-click that particular family and click edit. It will open up the family and as you can see it's nothing more than some lines that are creating a closed loop exactly the length, that, the width if you will, that you want. If you need this to be longer then just keep adding these uh, corrugations to the ends until you have, still have a continu clean continuous loop. Um, once you've revised it, save it, load it back into project <clears throat> and overwrite the one that you have. This path here, in order for you to lengthen that path, just select it. And you can see Pick Path. So if I click it, it'll turn that uh, dark green line into a magenta line. And if you select a magenta line, that's actually the length of the actual path. And if you want to increase it, you just use the dynamic dimensions that pop open, temporary dimensions. Um, or you can just grab the ends like this and you can pull it. When you finish, hit the green check mark. This will be to tell the software to finish the creation of the path. And now that that path is finished, you can hit the green check mark again to finish the creation of the sweep and will update the length of this family file. Then you can load this into your project and use it accordingly. That's it.